Just the other day, I made a video trying to answer a question that I was getting a lot in both my comments and on Twitter. And the question was, will Windows 11 be coming to the Surface Duo line of smartphones? And my answer to this question is and was a resounding no. Microsoft has no intention of bringing Windows 11 to the Surface Duo or Surface Zeta, which is the, the code name for Surface Duo 2. Surface Duo 2 will run Android 11. However, and this is a big however, there's a certain little news story making the rounds on the internet, which I'm sure some of you guys have seen, maybe some of you hadn't. And it might be enough to sort of generate some excitement as to things that have the slimmest of chances of happening in the hacker community, but something that isn't totally impossible. So what am I talking about? I'm hinting about a lot of things. I'm not saying a whole lot. Let's look at what I'm talking about. This tweet was sent out just uh, yesterday, June the 29th, so two days ago, rather. And this individual, yes, has Windows 11 running on the 950XL, the Lumia 950 XL. And from all accounts, it appears to be working uh, way better than it really has any rights to be running. As you can probably not see here, of course, it did have a Snapdragon 810 processor. This thing is quite old at this point. But because of the way that this thing was made, it can run Windows on ARM. And so updating to Windows 11 isn't that big of a deal for this thing. And when I saw something like this, yeah, I, look, I'm right with you guys. My mind immediately jumped to Windows 11 is going to have Android app support. What if they tweaked Android 11 to give you a dual monitor experience on Surface Duo running proper Windows? What would that be like? I mean, look, we, we can only imagine what it would be like because not only do we not have this, the only way we're gonna get it is if hackers like this gentleman uh, and his, the team that worked on this with him, uh, if they get it going. And crazily enough, it only took them about a day of work. <laughs> and he posted this video here, right? And um, I'm just gonna show you a portion of it because obviously you know if you want to see the whole video you're gonna you're gonna need to go uh, to the link in the description and you can watch his video which you know has 71,000 views already but I'm gonna kind of give you a little snippet here of what we're talking about and and I'm shocked at how well it runs it's much more snappy and reactive responsive than than you would think it would be he drags windows around he resizes windows snap is all working really surprisingly well. So yeah, take that concept, spread it out over the two screens on the Surface Duo, and w what a crazy concept that is, right? That could be absolutely incredible. And again, I can't stress enough, this is not coming from Microsoft. Someone like this guy's gonna have to do this. And what's truly, really strange about this situation is that apparently gets able to take phone calls. He posted these screenshots of an incoming call. <laughs> Cellular data is working just fine. And this is not something that's super crazy because there are LTE connected ultra books and things like that. So it's not crazy that it's able to do that. But the fact of the matter is, is that it has telephone abilities in the software. Now, obviously there's another place you could go with this and that is Surface Neo. And I, I don't think Neo's dead. I think Neo is still coming and I think Windows 11 is going to be really awesome on Surface Neo because it is, look, what did they do? They made it super good with touch screens. They've reworked Windows 10 to make it much more touch friendly. They're adding Android apps to the uh, Microsoft store. This, all the things I've said that would make Windows 11 cool on the Duo would make it cool on Neo as well. And, and I think that's something we're actually going to get. Now, all this being said, I'm going to have to pump the brakes a little bit because look, in concept, I totally get why everybody is like, oh my God, this is going to happen. It's going to be amazing. But let's pump the brakes a little bit because he, he responded to this question on Twitter. Only the Lumia 950s have an ARM64 capable SoC and thus can run Windows on ARM. Can it be done on other Android phones? Technically, yes, but it's going to be really, really difficult. Performance is going to be really bad, and drivers are going to have to be figured out. No Wi-Fi, no GPU, no cellular. And in fact, someone got Windows 11 running on the OnePlus 6T. But here's what we're talking about. While touchscreen, USB, and GPU are partially working, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, audio, and I'm assuming... Uh, cellular as well because they don't mention if that works or not are not working right so there's a lot 
There are a lot of hurdles to jump to getting something like Windows 11 running on the Surface Duo form factor. And it's important to address the fact that the OnePlus 6T is a standard slab smartphone running older hardware. So take all the complications of getting this to work on the OnePlus 6T and then understand that getting this to work on the Duo will be orders of magnitude more difficult. This is a dual screen device with far less development time and far fewer people, let's be honest, working on it. But I wanted to address this because I thought it was really cool and I wanted to kind of give some details here to answer the questions that I knew I was going to already start getting. But Shane, Windows 11's on the Lumia 950 XL already. Why not put it on the Duo? It's going to have Android apps. Why not put it on Surface Duo? Well, I get it. I'm with you. I understand. I'd love to see it happen. But if it does, it's going to take a lot of work from enterprising individuals like the gentleman whose tweets I've been showing you. So as always, thanks for making it to the end of today's video. If you'd like to support the YouTube channel, support uh, me directly, either head to scariafloatrill.com or check out my Flatter account in the link in the description. I'll have a link to the video that this gentleman posted in the description as well. Stay tuned for more coverage of Surface Duo, Surface Neo, Windows 11, and alike in the coming days. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends. <laughs>